Special Counsel Jack Smith on Tuesday filed a new indictment against Donald Trump over his efforts to undo the 2020 presidential election that keeps the same criminal charges but narrows the allegations against him following a Supreme Court opinion conferring broad immunity on former presidents. The new indictment removes a section of the indictment that dealt with Trump's interactions with the Justice Department. That's an area of conduct for which the Supreme Court in a 6-3 opinion last month said Trump was entitled to immunity from prosecution. The updated criminal case no longer lists as a co-conspirator Jeffrey Clark, a Justice Department official who championed Trump's false claims of election fraud. Trump's co-conspirators were not named in either indictment, but they have been identified through public records and other means, according to the Associated Press. The special counsel's office said the updated indictment filed in federal court in Washington was issued by a grand jury that had not previously heard evidence in the case. The indictment retained the allegations that Trump attempted to pressure then-Vice President Mike Pence to refuse to certify the electoral vote count. Chief Justice John Roberts wrote for the court that the interactions between Trump and Pence amounted to official conduct for which, quote, Trump is at least presumptively immune from prosecution, end quote. The question, Roberts wrote, is whether the government can rebut that, quote, presumption of immunity. The Associated Press contributed to this report.